Hello everyone. Oh, can I have a bottle of water please now? Oh, look back. Hello Sandra. Oh, I hope you're back home at some of our thank God already. Yes, this weekend. Um Sandra, I will text you. The classes. I think I can get it on my phone. Or Quentin will. I'll get Quentin to text it to you, Sandra. Somehow we're going to have to. Yeah. Um, get you to the classes. And anyone else that can't. What's it, week 47? Is it? I'm getting there. Was dad not logged into Facebook? Dad was, but I'm not going to scrub his dad underneath his account and I have my own. As much as I love my father, um, I am not him. Are we done? I am just trying to make it available card making class i'm just adding it to the guide and putting the tag on it so anyone that comes late sorry everyone okay hello d and debbie and chloe and trish and robin hello karen happy birthday well oh, karen was one of our winners today and so was chloe hello tanya and jacqueline tash beck Pam and thank you Debbie thank you everybody that's left messages it is going to take me a month of Sundays to reply to everybody and I went oh I don't have time to reply to everybody so I shouldn't reply to anyone because then I'll upset people and leave people out and then I've thought about it and gone oh that was just silly Elisa so I'm gonna have to try and work my way through I have done Almost all my fussy getting. I haven't been back to this for a while. So, oh. so, uh, let's push that. Let's move that down here. Put that up there. Let's do that. Do that. Okay, so you know what I might do, Sandra, is I might put it on the, um, I'm going to use the blog more. So uh, Sandra not being able to access her emails or her Facebook account has really taught us that if this happens to anyone, we need to have some sort of way to communicate with you other than the traditional ways well email usually works but because sandra's not receiving her emails which is such a bugger um just technology doesn't it drive you nuts um yeah so we're just gonna have to start using the blog more i think i have started putting the weekly class info up on the blog and i did start that just before sandra got hacked it's not the reason why she got hacked and why she got blocked out of um, Facebook. But I had thought about it previously that if people couldn't access Facebook, how are they finding out about the classes? And if they couldn't access their email, especially now that we're really being, I'm being really, really strict on the 16 hour rule. So if you've received an email from us because you've made an order or some other reason within 16 hours, you don't receive another email, like it, there's a gap. And I'm being particularly strict on that. I don't want to be outside the software, outside the guidelines. So I've got three bits of craft. 
and all this stuff. And we're making a card, aren't we? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just, I've really been um, on the hop lately. I don't recall the last time I stopped. Just gonna move this back here. That's all. Okay. Let's put two bits in play of craft for tomorrow night for cards. Now there's no scrap from class Friday night. It's Saturday night and Sunday night. Saturday night is Aussie grunge. And Sunday night is you'll have to wait and see. What am I gonna do? Do you know me? I'm gonna read read messages for a minute. Hello Mary. Thank you, Diane. You mustn't have heard it at the shop. Chloe was at the shop today. Thank you for helping the last two days, Chloe. Hang the stock. Chloe's just been a godsend helping us hang stock. Oh, what an awesome achievement. Thanks so much for my prize and collection. Yes. Now, now they won't get activated till Tuesday. Trust me, when you see what's going to go on on the weekend, you are going to understand why that's not happening till Tuesday. You will really, truly understand when you see what we're doing over the weekend. Yep. It's something we haven't done for a while. And yeah, it's mad lunacy. I don't know why. We don't. But yeah. It just coincided with our birthday. I had a few things I haven't fussed about here. Caroline did not think we had our Shop of the Old Stitches and Craft Show that be held at Rose Hill Race Sports. I don't think so. Hello Karen, hello Naomi, hello Deborah. What's up? I'm not getting my any email since last Thursday due to something Luca has done. I have to have it fixed soon. I will call the shop tomorrow to pay for Oh no D. Who knows what he's done? Hearing me. He's probably um blocked everybody that you wanted to get emails from. Hello Marie. Thank you. Happy birthday. Been meaning to ask for a while. Did you ever have your shop stall at the old station? No, I didn't. We didn't do Rose Hill. A theatre card. What's a theatre card? Excuse my ignorance. Um, don't worry. When we get it up and running, we will do some tutorial videos on blogs. What? Oh, no. It's just like a website information. So the blog is like, so if you go to the online store, it's down on the left, and you just click on it, and it's just like information. You don't do anything. You just use the read the information. It's just a place for us to provide you with information. That's all it is. You don't have to log in or do anything fancy. Okay. Theatre card. What on earth is a theatre card? You have to excuse my ignorance, eh? Hey? Oh, 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 oh. Uh, finally had my go. Oh, Beck, so wonderful. Well, not wonderful you had to have an operation, but wonderful you've got it done. Yes, speedy recovery. Do as they tell you and rest. Rest, Beck, rest. Curtain comes across slider card. Oh, dear. That sounds complex. Oh, no, like, you know how, like, you would only keep the video and everything like that? I get to it. Yeah, that, that sounds, uh, Louisa, like that might be something where I need to do some research first. <laughs> that doesn't sound like an on-the-fly. Sounds awesome, but sounds like it might be something I might like to make. You never know. Yeah, Hello, Robin. Care. Yes, do take care, Beck. Hello, Beryl. Sounds up. interesting. Let's, let's, let's write that down. Got a pen. Sort. And I need a piece of paper. Yeah, it's... I've got sticky notes, the small oh, sticky notes in the pot. Really? Even with glasses on, I cannot see that. See? Yeah, no. That's, that's like too far. I'm just sticking it there to my power board. Okay, so you know how you build that bookie thing and it's 
um, last year. The booky thing. Yep. Imagine that, but like as a theatre. Yep. In curtains. Yes, lots of rest. It's a nice card. I'll have to Google that. I have to ask Sir Google about it. Um, actually, if you missed, I need to cut the card. If you missed Friday night, I need to show you this. We ran out of cardstock because it takes four sheets of cardstock and then certain of you bought wads of cardstock. Uh, but that's okay. It's all cool. There's more cardstock already ordered. Um, this was Friday night's class. So front cover, back cover, and then we've got a pocket here. And this is a pocket here. And this one opens. And then this comes down. And this opens and this comes across and up and across and down and across. It's meant to be called a maze car, a maze book, but we're calling it a spiral book because it's a spiral. Hey team, I want a prize. Thank you so much. <laughs> and for Quentin, can you let him know I wasn't able to respond in three minutes? No, that's okay. You don't have to respond in three minutes, Karen. You'll just get an email with your code next Tuesday. Dad was trying to be humorous. Dad thinks he's funny. Yeah. Yes. Uh, I don't know. Did Was D one of the winners? I don't know. I left the tickets at work. Hello, Lorraine. Thank you for the birthday wishes. Sorry, I even tried it. Oh, sounds awesome, Diana. Did you get to share it? You need to share it in the group maybe. Hello. Oh, thank you, Jason, for the birthday wishes. I love seeing what people make. I don't always comment, but I'm a bit, I'm a bit of a, if Quentin and I had the opportunity, we'd live on a deserted island as hermits. And they get up there. <laughs> We're not They're the not most so. social creatures on the planet, which is really funny considering what we do <laughs> and how much I have to talk. Everyone comes in and talk to me. Um, Hello, Diane. It was a wonderful day, yes. Yeah, yeah. He thinks he's funny, doesn't he, Chloe? Yeah. Q is funny. Yeah. He's at, wait, I have just scoffed some dinner. I've actually got indigestion because we were running so late. Oh, Chloe's almost finished hers. Uh, that's okay, Dee. I'm sorry. Maybe next time. But, yeah, so that was our mini book no I'm just thinking I think I've got an idea the least amount of instruction as possible. No. So from a piece of our 12 by 12 craft, I'm going to cut a 6 inch by 12 inch piece. And I'm going to cut a... I'm going to cut an 11 inch... Yep. By five and a half inch piece. And right. Yep. No. No, no. And then from this piece of paper two from on safari 
we're going to cut a five and three quarter inch by five and three quarter inch. Are you remembering to put it up on the screen? Mm -hmm. Right. Do I look like Dad? I'm like, I'm like Dad. Do I look like Dad? Oh, I should have brought them home. Nana Sue came in today and I haven't seen her. I saw her on Saturday. but And she brought in some photographs from Amelia's christening and I don't have those photos because mine are on the hard drive that one of the hard drives that discombobulated. And then there are photos. Yeah, it was really interesting because Milton was just short like just barely short of um, 16. Had you already turned 14? Naomi was either just short or just over 14 and he was just before. short of 17, sorry. So he was 16, nearly 17. And it's amazing how similar the boys are and the girls and just, yeah, there, was a heap, there were a heap of photos. It was really lovely. So from paper two, we're going to cut that again, five and three quarter by five and three quarter. Yeah, we're going to do that twice. I'm going to do two of those. And then we're going to build our structure so I can show you what we're making. I have an idea. But we have to be significantly scroogey. Oh, for anyone who doesn't know, we're currently doing the uh, instructions on the banners. Yeah, we're doing the instructions on the banners. That's a cool knitting book. Hello, Donna. Thank you, Donna. Thank you for the birthday wishes. Hello. And I think, was Donna one of the original? Winners? I think Donna might have been one of the winners as well, one of the I don't 20 know why winners. You're I was trying to focus on not looking at the tags on call them out so they're not on the oh, Okay. Um, thank you, Donna. We love it. And we love it when you guys spread the word about how cool our shop is. This weekend's gonna be really awesome. So okay, I'm gonna tell you what is going on this weekend. So we have been silly and sign am I allowed to tell them? Yeah, I can, can I? I can now. Trust me. I'll show you later. I can now. The the beans are out. Oh, they sent, they put up a post. No, the beans are out. Um, we're doing the great international craft show, the online craft show this weekend. So we've got classes all weekend, and we've got new products coming out on Thursday, Friday, Saturday in Sunday. So we've got new products and we're going to daily round up on Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Um, we've got four classes on Thursday, three on Friday, four on Saturday and four on Sunday. Um, we're going to feature things like alcohol inks. We're going to have some reels playing on our story. Well, I'm not anything to do with that. That's just for you to That's stop me. talking. That's nothing to do with me. Um, so we're going to do some alcohol ink stuff. We're going to do some cards. We've got a little bit of a fun thing on Saturday morning, which is going to be quite hilarious. We used to do them. Actually, we, we've done them before with lots of people, but we're going to do it just between the two of us. The, the funnest one I've ever competed in was we did it, Milton and I did Don't it. tell them what it is. No, Milton and I did it at a scout camp because we thought it would be funny to see these kids create something. Yeah. So and it was absolutely hilarious. So, yeah, we, we've got a lot planned. Um, you're going to get classes from both of us. Uh, they're interesting. They'll be on our Facebook page and my YouTube channel or the shop's YouTube channel and there'll also be stuff on Naomi's YouTube channel. So Naomi's class on Thursday night is going to stream to her YouTube channel, the Creative Family Group and our Facebook page. So I have lots of ways to watch stuff and see stuff and then I'll try and do blog posts where I put links in and at the end of each day or something. I'm going to try and do lots of things but I'll probably get like this much done of this much that I want to do. 
I want to do this much and I'm going to get this much done. But that's what we've been doing for a while. I've got whiteboards here behind me with, you know, products listed, new products, lots and lots of new products and fun products. Okay. I'm, I'm just going to read these comments and I'll go back. Sorry about the cardstock. I was running low. Oh, no. I don't even think it was you, Deborah, that bought the stuff that I needed for the kit. <laughs> And, you know, cardstock's great when you guys buy cardstock because it's a good staple and I want you guys to have access to good quality cardstock in your stash at home too. Oh, no, Karen, we are doing all different classes. We don't do same. No, 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 we don't do same. Karen, they're different. So they're different classes. So there are two alcoholic classes over the weekend and they'll be completely different and there'll be different classes. So we're going to have, what did I say? So we've got 12... 15 classes and they're all going to be completely different. So it's 15 completely different classes. If you thought we were looping beforehand. And we'll do a weekly, a daily roundup each day. No, you don't tell them about that. That's a surprise. There'll be a surprise each day too. Oh, and there'll be specials. <laughs> but some of the specials you've got to watch the classes to get. Um, I'm just going back over here. Da, 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 da. Oh, yeah, we're um, keep freezing as she's on YouTube. What we're dealing with that? No, so I'll keep freezing. Oh, well, it goes back to the start. I just figured out I could fast forward the replay. Oh, okay. Well, Sandra, you just learnt something we all needed to know, that we can fast forward the replay after it freezes. <laughs> oh, no. For a change, we don't have a storm. Okay. So the two pieces of craft, we're going to fold them in half. I need to get moving. And I'm going to make sure that the outside is the same because remember craft has two different colours, so I'm going to make sure the outside's the same. And we're, we're going to be rather scroogey here, so we have to be to get our, this out of one piece of cardstock. So it's one card. And here's the other one. That's going to flip up. But so in here. I want to put a gift card pocket, right? But to do that, geez, I'm going to run out of paper. We'll be right. She'll be right. I think I'm going to run out of paper. This is the first part. Yeah, I know. <laughs> to do that, we need to, so on our card base, we need to cut the middle out of our front. Oh, where's my scissors? Where's my tub of stuff from today? I have to actually stamp and fussy cut 44 of these before 1 o'clock tomorrow. Oh, I might be doing it tomorrow morning. I might have to outsource to the ladies to help me get my project done. I've still got to do a watercolour tree, fingerprint tree too. Before tomorrow. So I'm going to cut the middle out. About half an inch or a centimetre in. So we need that. Rightio. So on the inside, we're going to stick, oh, which one do I want on the front? That one or the light one? Let's put the light one on the inside. So we're going to stick that in there. So this is the big card. We cut the hole, a hole in the front of the big craft piece. Not the little craft, the big craft. If you cut down a little one, we can overcome and conquer that. So we've cut the hole in the, in the front of the big craft piece. And we're going to stick one of our five and three quarter by five and three quarter pieces on the inside.
He is Amelia Anne. Coming. She's too busy crafting. Right, don't look at the back. Rightio. So then the other piece of five and three quarter by five and three quarter animal print, we're going to cut the middle out of. Yeah. Oh, I don't know why I just peeled that off. Did you just start that to print? Maybe. Oh. Please don't judge me right now. I did just start this to print without thinking too clearly. However, well, it doesn't matter. I'm not worried about more. And then. One of our our smaller one, we're gonna stick it on. So this piece of craft was eleven inches by five and a half inches. Card's probably not going to stand up particularly well. Well, it might. You never know. And I don't normally stick things together like this, but I really wanted to show you what we were doing before we got too far along. This would be great to put the photo in. Can we have the fan on, please? It's really hot here. It was cold a couple of weeks ago. Now it's hot. What do you own? Yeah, that's gonna that's gonna hold. That's not too bad. Two more? Yeah, thanks. Yeah. So if we put a bit of this on the front. Numbers here. Oops, I, I think I forgot to order these numbers too. I meant to order them. I could just do a 49 and store them away for Clinton's birthday. You know what I could do? I could do a 30 and send it to my a 25, not 30, 25. I hope my son doesn't hear that. I could just do a 25 and send it to our son. <clears throat> our oldest son, the kid's big brother, Milton. And if you, you know, Milton used to be the one that parceled up your orders back in the day. Back, um, Milton is 25 next week. I thought it was this thing. So let's do like a bit of a group of animals somehow. I'm surely sorry for the parental noise. I did not know this document was 14 pages long before I printed it. The university friend asked me to read her your sister's grade 12 assessment. Not grade but, 12, grade 11 assessment. Oh, so you're proofreading someone's sister's year 11. Why isn't she doing it? Because she's got dyslexia. She's Fourteen pages. Shouldn't she have finished? Year eleven. Yeah, but year eleven should be finished all her assessments um, on him. Oh no, it continues on. No, it continues on, and she goes to a, like a county dance. Group. Oh, is this the dances? Yeah, yeah. And then the numbers. Sort of here. Okay, I 
think I've got an idea. Okay, so this piece of paper number four, we're going to... I'm going to cut from down this bottom area here. And we're going to cut a piece that is... Carefully remove the barcode. We're going to cut two pieces that are five and a quarter inches by five and a quarter. One, two. I need to read the comments again because my friend is printing her year 11 assignment. Five and put it by five and four inches tall. Yeah. Oh, my God. And maybe I might buy a BWS gift card. So what I'm going to do, even though on the outside I've got the brownie craft, not the yellowy craft, on the inside it's the yellowy one, so I'm going to do the yellowy sort of one. And let's work out how big we need this to be. This needs to be... So we need to, from this... Cut a three and a half inch by three and a half inch square. So by cutting a square, it, it means that it's nice and easy. So three and a half by three and a half. Sorry? That's why I'm making them a bit, making it so it fits. Okay. They're meant to be a standard size. Yeah. How am I going to do the classes? I may have to tell hubby and grandkids I'm busy and I'm a guy. Oh, yes, everyone's going to take a holiday this week. Yeah. yeah, we told you to mark the calendars <laughs> and book off sick. Um, so, yeah, we're going to do quite a bit on the weekend. They're all going to be saved, but. And we'll do an album probably in here. Actually, they'll all be in either this week's album or the, an album there are. Or they might be in two different albums or something somehow. Okay. So we're going to put that there. So let's put a piece of so from paper number five let's cut a strip that is three and a quarter by three and a quarter inches I actually made this pattern paper like I took all the images and put them together and then all the different very happy when I do that I get what I want so we're going to make two pieces that are three and a quarter by three and a quarter. So we're going to make two of those. Oh, dear. 
I know what she's doing too. We're not beginning Oops, too hard. Yep. Okay. So let's build our gift card holder. So I'm going to stick this three and a quarter by three and a quarter to the three and a half by three and a half of craft. So let's stick that on. Now we can't cut the middle out of the craft or the gift card's going to get snagged. I'm going to get like some stronger tape red tape it's quarter inch red tape I'm going to put this on three sides one just working out because I had an idea on what was up to me two so you do need a stronger tape for this because this is like a an engineered piece this is a piece that needs to be important So red tape. Red tape. So what we're going to do is we're going to get a gift card and sit our gift card in. Our, shut the door. Sit our gift card in our pocket. If you stick it on without the gift card in it, it'll be hard to get it in. Whereas if you stick it on with the gift card in, it is much better. So I'm going to peel this off. You could just sit the gift card down on there and stick over the top of it. And then I'm going to sort of do an even top and bottom and then sort of like a half inch on the side. Even-ish. And then what we're going to do is we're going to burnish that so there's no air pockets in the tape which can cause it to oxidise and let go in time. It's a long time but it's still time there we go and then we're going to put this little guy in here and i think we're going to use foam because i can oh look it's on the outside Marie says she loves little animals from the other safari they are cute i reckon a spiral book is going to look awesome i can't wait to see if someone does a spiral book in on safari i think um, mary was going to do it with her grandson oh, well someone was going to someone was saying they were going to go and let's put tape on the back of this don't look at the back of this so I recently started doing some exercises for my vertigo and he did tell me it would make it worse and he was right recently is Sunday for life no no I did them today as well as he said Sunday. every second day to start with Sunday I started and I got a lot worse. Um, today I was worse through the day, but last night, so I didn't do the exercise yesterday. Last night I was, I actually slept a lot better. I was actually, the vertigo was a lot better last night than it's been any other night. So that was really good, but it did take, you know, 36 hours. <laughs> plus for the vertigo to improve actually nearly 48 hours. 36 hours it was actually before it improved so i haven't felt too great today but i'll get there so inside we've got this yeah
need. That is pretty. Okay, we're gonna use that. So, we're gonna cut a piece of glitter card that's five and a quarter inches by five and a quarter. And we're gonna trim this piece of green down to five by five. piece of glitter card we're going to cut the innards out of I'm going to cut the innards out of it and you do need to do this because it's really hard to stick to glitter cards so you need to cut the middle out so that you can actually um, adhere it and then this glitter card we're going to cut to a three and a half by three and a half inch piece so let's cut a three and a half by three and a half and then cut the middle out. You thought I was going to forget the glitter card again. A couple of times lately I've forgotten the glitter card. Okay. So let's stick the green piece to the bigger piece of glitter card. This green is now five inches by five inches. And what we're going to do is stick it to the five and a quarter by five and a quarter glitter card. Make sure that fits. Yep. Now, as soon as we stick this on, what we're going to do is we're going to turn it over and put our tape on the back, but we're not sticking it down yet. So we're going to stick that on. And because it's going to let go, what we're going to do is we're going to use a wire tape and stick it and straddle across, hold it in place. And then what we're going to do is we're going to get these two. We're going to stick our little three and a quarter by three and a quarter leaf collage. So if you're doing the Peace and Joy virtual retreat in two and a half weeks' time, um, some of the kits have left. Uh, we didn't get any sent today. Oh, no, we did get some sent today, actually. Um, what... There are extras in the virtual retreat group to buy, extra goodies, but those extra goodies are not what's in your kit except maybe a couple of flare buttons. Are you right there? Yeah. Go on. Um, so, yeah, there are extras in there. Do we want to put that flat or raise it up? Yeah, I'm just working out. I'm going to put this on foam. And we need to make sure that the foam straddles across the join between the glitter card and the front piece of card. Mm. Like says that she's going to have to get some relief from the vertigo. Yeah, I hope so. Yeah. Oh, I've had enough. 
I've really had enough of the lack of freedom. And Quentin having to drive everywhere. And he's had enough of having to do everything. Because he would normally stay back and do postage at the, be at the store working late doing postage. And I would do like robotics and school run and dancing and all those other things. Whereas he's having to do the school runs and all the other runarounds. And he's not enjoying it. Be fair though, Dad has never enjoyed um, pick-up time from schools. Of course there's an argument happening. It's a day ending in Y. So I'm going to put my animals on fine as well. Because I can. I'm going to stand my zebra and I'm just going to have just a tiny bit of his nose hanging over and a tiny bit of foot hanging down. And they are animal, but I forgot what it's called. It's not a meerkat. Which one is this It's a dairy looking thing. Oh. It's not an impala either. Okay. Um, Marie says that she's glad that there's no more school rooms for her. Mm. She doesn't have to worry about them. She's got a few more. I need 10 more years. Amelia's here to say goodnight. I'm going to stick this on before she turns up. Send it to your brother. Oh yeah, but I already gave him a gift. I already gave you already him. sent him a card yes, that had really, glitter in it. Really sent him the gift of sequence. And it was sequence. <laughs> and it was two cards in one envelope. Two cards in one envelope. You made him. Good night, hello, goodbye. Dad put the cards in the envelope. Okay. Love ya. <laughs> See you in the morning. And no, you're not staying up later. Go on. I'm on to your game. I wasn't going to stay up there. I was just going to have Aww. one hug. <laughs> and then another hug. And then another hug. And then another hug. And then just one more. Just one more. Just one more hug. So I'm going to die cut some numbers. Don't know if you can still get these ones. But just a number that's around the right side. Oh, I'll just do something I've got in the way. Just one more thing. Just one more thing. Missy's been at my die cut machine. So Matt's out. Matt's out of the machine. So Missy's been at it. Yep, she has. Oh yeah, Missy the crafter. So she's been sleeping on supplies. So put the raised bits up because they're the cutting surface. And mine is a magnetic mat, and that's just you don't cut your magnetic mat. You cut your B plate. You buy two B plates for less than you can a magnetic mat. Now it looks like it's not cut, but it is. So it doesn't actually look cut, but it is cut. Mm. Let's sit that back underneath, just in case. Oh, I'm going to 
See, flip card is a bit tougher. It's cut, it just sits in there. Um, Marie said my cat is snuggled up alongside me, so while well, I do it while I'm doing some fussy cutting. Um, well, there you go. Well, I don't mind that. I usually don't like it. Nut. I usually like them with a shadow. Hmm. Let's cut another set out of this frame. This is from paper number six. So by cutting the cardstock down to almost the right size, what it does is it means that it is um, going to go through easier and it's actually going to cut better because the big piece of paper, the more excess paper on that you have in there, the less likely it is to work properly and it should work properly every single time. So we could put like a box. Oh, Paul says black shadow. Match the zebra. Maybe you could ink it black. Could. I'm a little bit of a fan of just a slight shadow of one of the colours that's in the background. I'll show you in a sec, I'll lift it up. I don't think I've done this much since starting online classes. I should do go back and do see just a slight shadow. Just a slight bit. So to do that, I don't stick one set down and then the other set because then you've got your between gap is a bit hinky, it's a bit not right. I think I've got the glue out of that. So what I do is I actually stick them together, not on the project. And my shadow goes sort of down and slightly to the right. No. You can ink it when you make it. You make the card yourself and you can ink yours. Mm, I'll do that when I have a day off. Yeah. When well, I have a day off on Christmas, oh, we don't get a day off on Christmas Day because we've got the advent calendar. Maybe we should. Oh, no, I'm not sure. I was going to say, why don't we start on your brother's birthday on the 30th of November? So then we get Christmas Day off, but we shouldn't do that. That's wrong. As it is, we reveal the advent calendar before most of the world has started that day. Before COVID. Oh, it's crooked. Well, 
it seems a bit of a dodgy move by us. Mm. I'm not a man of a big thing, I'm sure. Flat on time. So when you do the shadow, it actually makes your letters a little wider so you can put foam, it's easy to put foam behind them. Let's put them on foam. What's your assignment like? Mm, I'll write a page. I'll decide I'm going to read it when I go to bed. What's it about? It's a law assessment. You didn't do law. Nope. Brother did. Oh, I also have a math assessment to read. Are you just doing grammar? Yes. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's not terrible. Not the first. It's like people who put their Christmas trees up before the first of December. Yeah, no. Quentin would just lose his cruet if I asked him to find the Christmas tree. We actually don't put our. Sometimes we put our Christmas tree up Christmas Eve. We wait until all the kids are home. We're going to put it up before Melton gets here this year. Because he's only coming home for two days. So, I'm going to keep these because they're handy. Um, Quentin would just really lose his cruet if I asked him to drag out the Christmas tree this week. <laughs> He's just like, no, 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 no. He's away on the weekend. Quentin and Noah, because it's Northern Nationals on Sunday at Rothwell. Robotics. Okay, so here's our card. Yep. And then we open this up. I'm going to get the card in here. And then right here. But we've got that because we have to. And it kind of doesn't stand. <laughs> oh, it kind of does. It kind of leans on this bit here. We could have made this longer. Yeah. No. No. And you could decorate this if you wanted to, or you could write a message, put a photo there, write a message, and you've got plenty of space here to write a message. I love the card. I love this paper. Isn't it awesome? Yeah, 6.30 p.m. Queensland. Oh, I remember the classes on the weekend are all going to be, they're all going to be at um, Queensland time. Let's see if I can see. Oh, 
put an inch. Okay, I'm going to do something. That up there. I'm just going to flash up on the screen a thing for the weekend so you can take a screenshot. I'm going to find it. It's our class list for the weekend. It was on the email. There we go. So that's our classes on the weekend. So you can see, um, yeah. They're the classes. Now, Saturday's times are a bit different because remember that i um, got to take um, Amelia, Naomi, and I are going to take mum, have to take mum for lunch, my 82 year old mum. And then I've got to take a grocery shopping. Well, actually, Naomi has to show for us because I can't drive. Um, and mum doesn't drive anymore. So we have to go grocery shopping. And then, yes, and then we're going to jam in my card making class and Naomi's class. And that creative builder Naomi's using is new. Basically, and the creative builder on Friday is new. And the creative builder on Thursday is new. Basically, all the product will be Basically, most of the product we're going to use on the weekend is new. And that's not a royal reminder. No, we've actually been working really hard. I think I need a whole packet of the Meerkat as colour cuts from the inside of the card. Oh, well, Here's right it all. down the suggestion. Meerkats, okay. So oh, actually had um, one of my lovely, lovely old old customers that I don't mean old as in old age I mean old as in she's been a customer for a really 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 truly 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 long time so she was in this afternoon and she's got to make like a million Christmas cards and she um she's making someone else's Christmas cards because um one of the card making teachers in town unfortunately passed away this year and her family still need Christmas cards to give, so this lady is going to make them for that family. I, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's what she was saying to me because she's filling in the gap there with those Christmas cards that she used to make, this late other lady used to make. Um, so Quentin shows her a product that we're releasing on Sunday, and she goes, oh, but I would like, I like that, I really love that, I'm going to buy those prototype ones you just let me touch because they're mine now. But can you make them for me by Friday in this colour instead as well? I'll have five packets. So we've got another extra colour for Sunday of something. But I can't tell you about. Because... Did you start cutting to the pile? Hurry. Yeah, I printed 10. Dad told me to print 20, but I only printed 10. I've got like... Yep. Oh, yep. 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 When you find out which customer it was, you're going to be happy about it. And I, I was there because I was laughing because the way that she said, because <laughs> the, the I've other, touched them now. Yeah, they're mine. And I laughed at it. So she's like, well, you know, my best friend had to go and die on me. <laughs> Don't say that. There's people watching this that know them both. It oh, funny. it was just it was... yes. So she's making cards. She's making the cards that she normally makes, and she's making her friends' cards as well. So it is such a lovely, lovely gesture. Gesture. So. She's busy making cards and she's got to make a heat tomorrow. So I think she, I think I've got to set up to make 14 tomorrow. But, yeah, it, it is going to be fun. It's going to be a fun weekend. We've done a lot of work and prep for it. So, And what I don't get finished for the weekend, I don't get finished. It's okay. I can release them later. But, yes, I think we definitely need meerkat colour cuts. Definitely. So if you came along and said hello, hello. If you left a lovely comment, thank you. If you wish us a happy birthday, thank you. It is the shop's 20th birthday today. Naomi John was with me today and she was with me on that very first day as well. 
when we went and did everything and she was only really little but yes we dropped Milton at preschool and then we went and did a whole heap of things and we opened a business and we ordered product and we ordered a computer and accounting software and we ordered printers and because all the research and everything had been actually some things had already been ordered the printer and computer had been ordered i think the computer arrived like the next day or the day after but yeah but yeah we opened the bank account we organized the fbos machine whole box and dice but yeah so she was there at the start and she's still there and quentin said to um some and i said oh well you know we'll still be around another 20 years and and I said, but it'll be Naomi John that'll be the hostess then, probably not me. And then um, Quentin goes, and for the hundredth, that'll be either Amelia Ann or her child that'll be running that, that party. <laughs> so Quentin has designs on us being 100 years old at some stage. Also discovered since I'm watching this a little bit behind you that I can pause it. There you go, Sandra. Bonus round. I love that. I love when we find awesome bonuses. But, yes, so thank you for coming along. Take care. Stay safe. Love is all. Thank you. If you're watching at this later, thank you for watching. Um, this is on Safari. It was our last release. It was in October. Oh, I love these little flowers. Um, and Peace and Joy is coming soon. Let's, it's just over two weeks until you can get your hands on Peace and Joy. I might get in the retreat extra goodies are available to you. Yeah. I'm, I'm cutting those madly in the next two days. Yes, yep, 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 yep. Because um someone designed a set of colour cuts that have a V dub in them and everyone loves them. But yeah. So I think I might put this up for pre order the paper packs next week. Let's just give me a little bit of a break for the moment. Quentin's having coronary spout the amount of work this could be. So take care, stay safe, love you all. And thank you for watching, whether you're watching on Facebook or on YouTube. And we will see you tomorrow night at 6.30 p.m. Queensland time. And we're going to make a scrapbook page. And I think we're going to do a double. We did a double last week. We might do a double or we might do a single. Oh, we could do a, a multi lap. No, if I start playing with it, I'll start making the page. No, can't do that. Naughty, naughty, naughty. So we'll see you tomorrow night. See you then. We'll call the shop tomorrow morning. Yes, okay, D. And D, while you've got no email, um, I've just got to remember that we'll just keep in contact with you by phone or, or text message and messenger. So, yeah. It's a huge catch Oh, thank you, Diane. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Thank you so much. You guys are the reason why we do it, and I love it. I love that I get to do something I love every day at work. Um, it's not work. It's a joy. Thank you. Take care. Stay safe. See you later.